Go. So today I'm going to be teaching you about rounding numbers, place value, whole numbers. Okay, place value, whole numbers, and decimals. What is rounding? Rounding is when you make a number about how much and not exactly. How do you round a number? Underline the place that you're asking for and round to the nearest thousand. Down to the nearest thousand, like say, so take 34,567 and round to the nearest thousand. So what you would do is underline that and you have to round up, so then you do the box of that number and the one next to it. And then what does 45 round to? 50? Yes. So then you'd put 3, then you put 5, and then you put your comma because it's there. And 0, 50. And then the ones at, the numbers after it right here become zeros. So it would be 35,000. And then, so your answer would be 35,000. And then, so that's rounding. Can you round, um, can mm -hmm. you round this number for me? So I'm going to make one with tens, right? Round that to the tens place. So underline your ones. Put a box around the numbers. And it's ten, right? Because you have to round down. So your answer would be ten. And then there's nothing else over here. So it would just be ten. Now we're going to do um, yeah. hundreds. Okay, Jack. Okay, Jack, it's fine. Now we're going to do hundreds. So what you would do is... What you would do is... <clears throat> it's the same thing. It's just we're going to do hundreds, so you're going to have a number after it. So round this to the nearest hundred. Round it to the nearest hundred. So underline your one. Put a box around them. And then you would And then you have the five after, so it's after, so you'd put a zero. There you go, so it's a hundred. Now we're going to do a thousand. So you do the same thing, just with thousands. Lily. Leave it, leave it, leave it. So then round that to the nearest thousand. And then you run. Very good. So that's rounding. Done. I'm done with rounding. Okay, and then what else do you have to show? You did rounding. Now, Jack, come here. Now I'm going to teach you about place value. Lily, stop. So place value, there's two. One is the value, and the Lily. other is place value. <laughs> Lily, stop. So, you can't be in the video, too. <laughs> so one is place value, and one is value. Um, so, I'm going to teach you about value real quick, and then I'm going to teach you about place value. So, the value is when you have a number and you tell them the value. So, there's thousands. Thousands. There's thousands here. Then there's hundreds, and then tens, ones. So, what so, would be the place value of the three? Mm -hmm. Thousand? Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. Yes, because it, the place. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Okay, so give on. wipe this away now and give well, him a whole new number and have him do it. It's in the threes spot, and I said thousand, so the number would be. So give him a whole new number and, and have him label everything. I'm gonna get no, you'll see. Give him give him a long number, Macy. Give him fifty six thousand. It's okay. You don't have to spell thousand. it, Jack. There you go. So now, Jack, point to the tens. Ten. Point to the ones. Point to the tha uh, hundreds. And point to the thousands. All right, that's well, the thousands, the ten thousands. thousands. It has a ten thousand. All right. Give him another number and see if he gets it correct, and then we know he's learned. Okay. Um, give him. Happen, yeah, give him whatever you want. Um, So, so where's the ten thousands? Very good. Yes. Where's the hundreds? Ones. Thousands. 